A friend once told me, wouldn't it be awesome to be able to make instant uh, ice? Wait, that was last year's video, oh yeah! And thanks to all of the support, my video was a big success. But this time, I'm not going to be playing with ice. I'm going to be playing with fire. Today, we are going to be making a fire snake. Check this out. For this experiment, we need 40 grams of sugar, 10 grams of baking soda, a lot of sand, a fire resistant recipient, and some lighter fluid. Next, we have to add our lighter fluid into our sand. Next, we have to add our baking soda and sugar mixture into the middle of our sand. Then, we just have to light it on fire. which are these, as I will explain later. After 15 minutes, this is what we obtained. But, what's going on? At first, we had baking soda and sugar. We added heat. And, uh, well, it made three chemical reactions. The first of these reactions occurs when sugar burns in the presence of oxygen. This produces carbon dioxide gas and water vapor, which pushes more of the mixture of sugar and baking soda upwards. Second, some of this additional sugar heats up but doesn't have access to any oxygen. So instead of burning, it just turns into solid carbon and more water vapor. This solid carbon now gives the snake some shape and also gives the snake its black color. Thirdly, the baking soda also decomposes in the heat, producing solid sodium carbonate, carbon dioxide gas and water vapor. Altogether, these three chemical reactions produce both the solid components of the snake, which are um, carbon and sodium carbonate, and hot gases. carbon dioxide, and water vapor. The sand in this experiment doesn't chemically react with anything in the growing snake. Instead, it evenly distributes the heat from the burning lighter fluid to the sugar and the baking soda mixture, ensuring a slow and steady burn and the growth of a long carbon sugar snake. And that is how you make a fire snake. But be careful not to burn yourself because the leftover sand is gonna be really hot. Anyways, if you like the video, make sure to like it and share it with everyone. It will be really helpful. <laughs>